development in the downtown area. How does free parking in downtown Raleigh sound? Not bad, right? The city just approved a pilot program to make these five parking garages right here free for the first two hours. So, okay, it's not 100% free, but it's something. Raleigh leaders are hoping that little things like this will make a big difference because they've got some big plans in the works. WRL Sean Gallagher shows us what's up with downtown. A buzz is coming back to downtown and can maybe be heard loudest here on Fayetteville Street with new things popping up seemingly every day, all part of the five year plan to restore the corridor. By Thanksgiving, five new restaurants will be open on Fayetteville Street, marking 11 new businesses here this year, sowing seeds for success in Oak City. So we're seeing tremendous progress on Fayetteville Street. We're really happy with where we were compared to a year ago. Downtown Raleigh Alliance President Bill King says it's about embracing the changing dynamics of the area. While downtown office vacancies are lower than the national average, there's still less daily foot traffic. Something hot dog vendor Kelly Colvin sees on chilly afternoons like this. When you come downtown Raleigh, there's either um, a restaurant or a lawyer's office. Nothing's wrong with either, but, you know, to bring more foot traffic, um, more flagship stores and uh, more small businesses to come and open up as well. One strategy is about making parking more accessible. It's why the city voted to make parking at these five garages free for the first two hours. But there's an ill-fated history of progress on Fayetteville Street. It was home to a pedestrian mall for about 30 years that failed miserably. What makes this plan for Fayetteville Street one that people should feel good about rather than a previous one that was a, a failure? Because it's focused on making Fayetteville Street live and breathe every day, not just for specific days because people like Kelly are out here every day. We just need more out here, but I do love Raleigh. The two hour free parking program will start in mid November and run until January when the city council will look over the results. If you're interested in finding out where these parking garages are, you can find it on our website. Just go to the don't miss it section to see where they are. Sean Gallagher, WRAL News in downtown Raleigh.